Good day, good sir. How might I be of service? You can start by explaining to me why you refused to honor the orders agreed upon with the guard. <laughs> There's been a misunderstanding, sir. Of course we're ready to honor the orders. In fact, I've already had a word with your master at arms. They're asking that we pay again, despite having already paid. It's just that the price has gone up since. I've nothing to do with it. This is inadmissible. If you agree on a sum, you need to honor that agreement. I'm sorry, sir. I'm just an agent. And I'm only obeying orders. Why don't we go and solicit other suppliers, Kurt? When we've already paid for the merchandise? If these thieves agree to reimburse the original payment, it's what we do immediately. And do know, in the future, we won't be shopping with them. Well, to I be honest, Kurt, I don't think this kid can actually see. It's, he looks like he, he, he's blind. <laughs> don't know Your why you agreed to, to do this right. with, so with a blind man. The I'll be damned. He probably doesn't. And I'm the one he's unable sense probably sense to count Gabby money, following Kurt. On. This whole st Your demand I'm not the one this stubborn. Well... There's a 50% chance that I can threaten him there, but there's a 100% chance I can threaten him right now, this is so... Preposterous. Oh, of Your course, that's the option. <laughs> I have no patience for bandits and robbers. Either you give us back what's ours, or we'll take it. Your idea of diplomacy isn't all that different from my own. Now to the devil with ya. Since you leave us no choice. The merchant's clerk isn't hearing you. Sorry, Green. A show of strength, that's the only choice, isn't it? I didn't know there was other choices in this game. What? <laughs> other choices than, sh than just threatening people and killing them. I'm uh, the Sardé, the bad diplomat. Let's go. They're all of a sudden. Yes, yes, don't hear me anymore. Very well. I'm counting on you to deliver this merchandise as quickly as possible. Yes, good sir. I'll take care of it immediately. That's pretty good. I stole all, all these clothes off that guy. Let's go. Let's go, Kurt. Let's go uh, mug some more people. One of these potions and force him to drink it. Excellent idea, Kurt. Let's take a look at his. Let's go mug the guy and steal his equipment. I love your ideas, Kurt. You're the best. <laughs> okay, Kurt. I think. Uh, this is his stuff over here. This is his potions. It's just a. Uh oh. And death to the oh. This, they have anti-mugging teams. I didn't did not expect the anti-mugging team being here. Uh, he just has the random guys protecting his crates. That sorted that out. Some brutal murder <laughs> sorts out. Our let's just let's continue the mugging. Come on. <laughs> okay, we got it. We stole his equipment. As you do when you're a, a diplomat. Um, it's daily routine of a diplomat, I think. It's just stealing equipment to prove that he's a charlatan. And uh, let's just steal all his chest here. I'm sure that's private. Let's see what what did we get that was private in there? says I got a brand new chest piece that's somehow better than my other one. It looks disgusting though. I'm not wearing that. That's disgusting. <laughs> Kurt, hurry up. We need to extort this old man. Let's go. Have you finally made up your mind? I happen to have a vial of your medicine. Would you be willing to drink it in front of us? To prove that there is no risk. This bullying is trying my patience. I'm beginning to suspect that you might be working for a rival. You refuse to taste it. You might have put something in it to cause me harm or further disgrace. No, look. The vial is still sealed. It comes straight from your stomach. Because I stole and it. you dare challenge me? 
when you have just admitted to being it's, a thief. It's not theft when you're a diplomat. You can see for Come yourself on. that I'm gladly returning your vial. <laughs> As a casual theft. This might help to dissipate my doubts, as well as those of these brave folk. <laughs> yes, no, I... How did he get convinced right? by that? I, I don't Damnation. even know, man. He got away. Do you know why? He can't have gone him? far. I mean, we we we, we admit Kurt to stealing his stuff, and he just was okay with that. Okay. We need to take. We've just uh, uh, agreed to smuggle stuff into the ship as diplomats do, um, uh, Kurt. Uh, let's smuggle for the coin guard. They asked us to get uh, some crates onto a ship uh, illegally. Uh, as you know, we're diplomats, so I will legally, illegally uh, smuggle it onto the ship. Fine. It's it's, it's totally fine. I'm sure it's not a crime or nothing. Kurt, let's uh, continue uh, extorting this old man. I think he lives in this tavern or something. Uh, for some reason, he doesn't have a house. He just uh, lives in the tavern. It's, it's, uh, it's just up the stairs. How do we go up? Is it over here? No, that's down. How do I go? Oh, through the door here. Oh, let's just steal this. Nice. Scooty left some of his. Uh, oh, let's just steal all the money off these poor people who are drunk, and uh, continue on. Um, I'm sure they won't need it. They're wasted. <laughs> and uh, let's find this man. Uh, the poor man. Oh, keys. Presume this is uh, to his bedroom or oh, storeroom. Where is the storeroom? So I can steal some more stuff. It's good we've we've stolen all of the storeroom equipment. I meant who leaves a set of keys just lying around for people to use? I mean, he must have wanted us to take all that. Um, oh, here he is, the the dip the 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 guy. Um, you again. What are you doing in my room? <laughs> I like I'm not the only invading one in people's rooms. Have you seen the mob that is gathering in the street? I'm neither deaf nor I haven't blind. seen them either, to be honest. I made that up. There's, the there's, there's no mob. Why didn't I leave the city while there was still time? <laughs> the Alliance Ambassador is quite unsettled by your commerce, and he is the one who sent me. Sahin? Him again. Ruining my career wasn't enough for him. He's the very reason I had to leave the Alliance. And here I am, playing the part of the... Are you not ashamed to have poisoned those poor souls? These potions are not harmful. That is to say that they don't contain any harmful ingredients. But you could just as easily produce real healing potions. So why don't you? Oh, you don't understand. I fled. But I haven't put a stop to my own research. This potion is an attempt to create in those who drink it a resistance to the Malachor. So you manipulate people to use this experimental fodder? That is completely unethical. I don't have a choice, but it does not harm them, I assure you. If this potion were inoffensive, then why wouldn't you drink it when I offered it to you? I ran tests on myself for such a long time that I ended up becoming intolerant to it. A small sip of this mixture provokes in me now a violent reaction. I mean, the mob would have been furious in any case, but a normal dose, I assure you, is without risk. Why does Sahin bear you such hatred? I was unfortunate enough to oppose certain great minds of the Academy. To criticize their methodology. I saw them inflicting torture on sick prisoners. Making them drink the most vile poisons. To find a remedy to the Malachor, they won't hesitate to kill. I could not keep my... It is for an act of... Dr. Sahin warned me that you were an imposter. <laughs> That doesn't surprise me, coming from him. I was a master alchemist. I understand if you don't believe me after all that. But I would still be one if Sahin hadn't set up a chain of machinations to disgrace me. Your methods don't seem so different than those of your colleagues. I don't torture people. And this potion only has... I know, I, I'm the doses. one that tortures people. Perhaps, <laughs> but you're hurting innocents. I cannot let your commerce continue. So... <laughs> I'm sure I was hurting me, you. Sir? Hurting a lot of people earlier, but um, 
Help him leave the... What? <laughs> I'm sorry, but I don't trust you. I'm going to deliver you to Dr. Sahin. Sir, I beg you to spare me. I've heard enough. You're under arrest. How unjust. And I'll steal this before I leave. <laughs> Kurt, what's going on? Wh what's going on with this man here? <laughs> Kurt, <laughs> what's he doing? I don't know what he wants. Kurt, do you have any idea what this man wants here? What is he doing? Anyway, back to the mission of trying to save my cousin from a drunken night out. <sighs> Every time. Okay, uh, we need to sneak into this base and try not to ki not try not to uh, not kill everyone. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Ammo. Mm, nice. Let's be stealthy, stealthy. Destroy this with. It's not possible just now. What? I don't know science yet. I'm not smart enough. It's blocked. Oh my god. How are we sick? There's another door somewhere else. What? We are pretty stupid. Let's go. Okay, this is the, l l the, the entrance for people who aren't very smart. Let's go down here. Okay, let's try to get through this horrific stealth st uh, like system. No, let's go. Don't be an idiot. It's obvious that he's a noble. A rich man. But you needed to be taught a lesson, but it's better we grab some coin. With all those posters we posted, someone with deep pockets will show up sooner or later to liberate the rooster. Oh, he's making a great deal of noise. We could knock him out or gag him. Ooh, a chest. A lot of garbage. Nothing up there. I don't think it counts as stealing in law if it is uh, people who have mugged somebody and, and kidnapped them. I don't think it counts as stealing, so it's okay. Just take everything, Kurt. Everything you can see. Fill your pockets. Oh, Kurt, uh, you're gonna meet my cousin. He's uh, he's amazing with first impressions. He, he, he's quite the guy. He, he'll he win you over. Well, this has been monumentous, gentlemen, but I have more important things to attend to. An island to govern, treaties to sign, riches to expedite, and a demanding father to impress! Constantine, it's me! My dear cousin! <laughs> my lucky star! Always there to pull me out of my fight. This is how we normally meet each other. <laughs> Every time a bottle to my face. We're best of friends, Kurt, don't you see? He tells me it's for affection. Yeah. He tells me he, he throws the bottles It's because it's it's he likes me so much. Enough said. Today we set sail for adventure. If you own But don't you think there are more pressing matters? Kurt, it is your highness's decision to make. Whatever it is, I shall follow. Well, my cousin says we should punish all these people, so... Of course that's the only option. Let's go kill them all. Uh, where are they? Downstairs? Uh, I think they're through here. Actually, we didn't check down here. We didn't bug this area down here. Maybe they're down here? Oh no, this is the smart guy's entrance that we were too dumb to get through there, as we can see. Uh, is there any more loot? Oh! It's good to see that you don't need to be smart to get all the good loot here. Serene's criminal key. I don't even know what that is, but it may be useful. Ha! Huh. 
And we were the smart ones in the end. We took the safe route out by mistake. For Constantine! Ha, <laughs> did you think we were going to leave safely? Ha ha ha! That's not going to happen. I like gun. Get out of the way, Constantine. I'm trying to shoot this man. Let's punch him on the crown. Ha <laughs> ha! What great cousin games. <laughs> we are so great cousins, aren't we? Oh, what are you doing over there, Kurt? By yourself. Oh, let me just... Let me just... Uh, this what I do to normal guys. I just shoot them with a gun. It works really well. Hey. Haha, <laughs> that's how you do it. <laughs> oh, I told you, Kurt, we have so much fun, uh, me and my cousin. We just have so much laughs. Look, I got this uh, really nice outfit from these guys. It, it gives me the whole uh, butcher, uh, murderer kind of feel. I think I'll, I'll keep this on for a while. <laughs> I seriously don't know what this guy is. He is really distracting. What does he want? Constantine, do you know? I have no idea what he wants. Drop a little soporific in their glasses, the way will be clear. I'll just need to find the proper ingredients, but it's doable. It's good that you've all thought that drugging some people is a great idea and some great fun, guys. Let's go for it. Okay, let's see what these heretics have to say. We've been found. I told you that the smuggler was not worthy of our trust. The man to which you are referring was arrested and thrown into prison, but revealed to me your hiding place. Oh, the traitor! Have you come to deliver us to the Inquisition then? Please, please, have pity on our souls. We have committed no crime. We are not heretics. We are nothing more than historians. In that case, why is the ambassador of Teleme so concerned about your teachings? Why is the Inquisition looking for you and why are you... Our only error was wanting to publish our work. It's true! We, we fled all the way to Serene, thinking we would be safe, but the Inquisition wants to silence us so... Tell me more about your research. What about it is so horrifying that it would provoke such a fuss? Our work concerned the teachings of St. The disciple of St. Matthias. The one who returned to Teleme after traveling... The very same. His writing was carefully preserved, but never seriously studied. With the discovery of Tirfredi, we thought it cr we wanted to verify if this island could have been the faraway place that he spoke of. And? What did you find? Tirfredi is without any doubt the land that our Saint Matthias... But the text that we discovered was radically different from what we expected to find. In the original text, Saint Lucius doesn't speak of an Eden of the Paradise of the Illuminated, he speaks of a voice that came from the depths of the Earth, which convinced St. Matthias to stay there. It was written in black and white, and there is no doubt about it. The I understand now what that text has cost you. This voice from the depths sounds more the power of a demon than a saint. The sacred texts are always difficult to interpret, but what is written? is written who are you we are we that did you try oh, we were it's i see i beg so mm, that gives me a couple choices let them be on their way propose to speak to the bridge alliance ambassador or the easiest option of proceeding to arrest them well, that's easy. I am sorry for you, but I must arrest you and hand you over to the ambassador of Teleme. We might be two poor historians. Yes, I was but listening we will not to any of your stories. Ourselves to the fire without a fight. Oh well, we'll and just have to murder them. I understand them. 
Better to die weapon in hand than on a flaming pyre. Now let's go and inform the Cardinal that their heretics are dead. Goddamn heretics. Always causing us issues. I had to use like three bullets there, it's a waste of ammo. Okay, Kurt, we're uh, looking for this little boy oh, or something. It's not really in my character. You are Lord de Sade. And I would like to have a word with your husband. He is not here, but perhaps I could be of help. It concerns a delicate matter. We're looking for a missing cabin boy. According to witnesses, he had an argument with your husband before being taken. I see. I am afraid that you have been misled. You seem to have come to the wrong conclusion. The cabin boy you speak of was not taken. He has simply returned home. Excuse me, but I'm not sure I understand. Don't you see, Your Excellency? We got our son back. I am very surprised. Several witnesses confirmed that your son had a fight with your husband and that his men escorted him from the tavern using force. If he had joined your husband willingly... Witnesses? In a tavern? And you choose to believe these drunkards over... These witnesses are all in agreement and it's their test... My son was probably shocked to have found us. My husband and the other men might have simply had to carry him. A gesture that your drunkards must have misunderstood. What was your son doing on a naught ship? Why would they have taken him? It is what they do. Through pacts and... What are you talking about? I would have thought that a legate would know... It seems that you have... This horror... You will have no... Where might I find your son now? I cannot say, Excellency, until the Nort... This pact? It sounds like some fear-inducing story. The Norts wouldn't be the first to recruit through dubious means. Kurt, I think she's talking rubbish. So let's go kidnap her son. <laughs> Why would we let her have him? Vasco, Vasco told us to kidnap him. Let's go. <laughs> with him. A handful of underlings don't scare us away. Right, cousin? Yeah, let's <laughs> try to remain discreet. Let's, let's go murder them in a discreet way. <laughs> Kurt, this is what me and my cousin get up to in our spare time. It's it's so funny, isn't it? <laughs> let's go kidnap a child. Sir so Sade, what are you doing here? I've come looking for your son. The Norts are worried about his disappearance. Uh, those Norts took him from us, but now we've got him back. And he'll blah, be Blah, 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 so blah. Uh. You've taken your son against his will and have him locked up like merchandise in a warehouse. Is that what you call being a good father? As if you would know what it is like to be a parent. You are far too young to understand the way we feel. I looked into the contract that binds you to the North. It was indeed... It is... Uh, it is so. But that sort of contract... You should have thought of that. The Prince... Her sadness... You wouldn't... Dare. You're not leaving me with a choice. Very well. Take the key and... All children leave the nest one day or another, sir. Farewell. No one tells me what child I can kidnap and tell me if I can or cannot kidnap. Jeez. Get out of my way, you old man. Where is he? Oh, this doesn't look like the right way. <sighs> Maybe it's... So it's here that I'm... It's not possible just now. Ah, I need to learn how to blow these walls up. It looks nicer. Ooh, stuff to steal. Nice. Always good to have some theft around here. I mean, I had the key, but lockpicking is fun. Okay, little boy. Come with us. Who are you? My name is the Sade. I am legate of the congregation. Your captain has sent me to find you. And were you able to convince my... My father to allow me to go free. Yes. Yes, that's what Even it is. Freedom. His arm a little. When you get kidnapped when you're a child. Me. And uh, uh, me to no meant to serve as a cabin boy. Mind. That's well, freedom. I feel more yes. sorry for my mother. She seems so. You don't see. I hadn't seen them since I was five. They find me. 
capture me and lock me up in this warehouse. My family is the Norts. Yes. You should still go and say farewell to your mother. Then find your way to the ship. I'll see you there. That's when you're brainwashed as a child. <laughs> you always want to go back to your kidnappers. They get kidnapped by one family, kidnapped by the other. I mean, the boy is just kidnapped all the time. It's fine. It's, 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 this is normal what we're doing. This is like a daily week for him. Kurt. Kurt. I do this all the time. I dress up as a sailor and I just walk through the Nuts uh, base Where is because... The manifest to be found? Because they... I've they, already they're, been to the port authorities. They keep the official documents upstairs. They're so silly, man. You could literally just stand beside them and they think you're one of them. And you can steal their equipment, like this. Take everything. It's really nice. Uh, and, uh... Just take everything and just run around their base. And, and none of them even realize, oh, hmm, that's not the guy that's usually on our ship. Because, you know, like, usually when you go on ships, you're like, you know everyone on the ship. Because it's like where you live for days and days and days and days. So you kind of get to know everyone on the ship. But these guys, you just put a little sailor outfit on and uh, they give you all their stuff. And this is how I, like, make a lot of my money. I just steal all their, their equipment every every time they come to harbor. It's it's what me and our cousin do for, uh, for Here's giggles. Here's the ship's manifest. We only need to add our merchandise to the list. There we are. That's us uh, put a legal stuff into the uh, ship now uh, for this uh, merchant's uh, the coin guard, I think. Uh, so we've committed a a crime, but it doesn't matter. Uh, as you can see, the knots are pretty stupid. Um, you just you can easily just do what you want. You just put a sailor outfit on. It's pretty funny. Anyway, it's time. I think I think we've cleared this. Uh, our uh, we've had enough fun, I guess. Um, it's time to go to our ship. Can we weigh anchor? We should be able to set sail with the tide, as agreed upon. My cabin boy, Jonas, is back on ship. I have you to thank, I imagine. Yeah, I you kidnapped do. him for the third it's kidnapping. It's a rather sad affair, and though solved, leaves a broken family behind. All we can do is plot a course. No one tells the wind what to do. I do thank you. Fasco, you're my type of so guy. For a cabin boy. Your actions bring we're totally more. okay with kidnapping. I think I think we're gonna be good friends. I think we're gonna be best friends. Uh, so it's time to go on board. Permission to board the ship. We are ready. Certainly. But keep in mind that we'll be at sea for several months. If you have any farewells to make or any final business to put into order, now is the time. Let's go. No, my house is in order. We are ready to embark. Perfect. Follow me. Eager to discover Tia Freddy. Oh wait, My actually, own. we My need to city. we need to steal You'll this. You need to arm yourself with patience. The okay, now, now we can go. I've been told the trip lasts months. And they say the place is full of gigantic creatures, as big as buildings. Oof. That's right. I heard a rumor the Norts even bought one. Oh, there's more stuff to steal. I doubt that. The Norts are strange, but they're not idiots. Well, well, they are pretty stupid. I mean, we did just steal all their stuff just by wearing a sailor outfit. They are pretty dumb. The beast is awoken! Those conniving, pistol-stealing, bridge-building liars. The creature was supposed to be out for days. They'll pay for this. What the hell manner of cargo are you transporting? Help! We need ropes! We must contain it! Help! You just can't contain that much thickness. That's just too much thickness to contain. Save my cousin. I don't care about you guys, but save him.
Let me peacefully put you out your misery. Now you're peaceful. Green blood. How do you fare? Fine. Just fine. casual murder. It is dead. Are you wounded? I'm well. Your lessons have proven effective. I've never seen a beast this size. It's quite extraordinary. Cousin, what a fight. You were illustrious. I'm not of the same mind. I had the feeling it was already weakened. It's no fun when it's weakened. It your humility remains a constant. But believe me, that battle was absolutely epic. cousin's enthusiasm is most impressive. And this journey is his long-awaited chance to prove his worth. He has a demanding father. More likely he's just happy to be free of this hornet's nest. I don't even know I am. That's certain. 